um, so Sanchez uh, they don't Saudi is the same level of enemy that Israel is to the regime so I think um, regime can't count can't count at least on China to make their back in a possible war um, while being a bigger ally with the enemy and about Russia they are already pretty uh, struggling in the Ukrainian war and based on the latest meetings of regime and Putin um, how seeing how disrespectful Putin treated to them I think they won't be a big help either uh, I don't know Sanchez that's not what I see that's not what I see I think one of the most solid allegiances in the world right now one of the most solid allegiances in the world right now is China Iran Russia I think all those three countries and they're a, they're a powerhouse Iran is much more powerful than Saudi Arabia much more powerful you can't even compare Saudi Arabia to Iran now I'm not talking about militarily I'm talking about influence I'm talking about people I'm talking about uh, just the spirit of what's there because Iran uh, Iranian people have something that the house of Saud has never had and never will right Iran is uh, the Iranian people have uh, tremendous amount of history and they have survived so much the house of Saud is novel the house of Saud has only been around for less than a hundred years or hundred years let's say right that's a that's a nation if you want to call it Saudi Arabia nation with only a hundred years of history under that name Iran Persia is a much longer much longer uh, player okay so I don't think China or Russia will abandon Iran for Saudi Arabia not by a long shot not by I could be wrong I could be wrong on this elder God a wise enemy is better than a foolish friend indeed Persian pro is a Persian proverb I thought it was um, uh, what do you call it Godfather It's better I, I say it as it's better to have intelligent enemies than stupid friends right this one is a wise enemy is better than a foolish friend yeah 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 